Hello fellow artists, voiceover M here. I just wanted to mention that I do have a channel membership option now, so on the join button, if you click that, um, you can become a creative bean. So for just $1.99 a month, you can get loyalty badges, custom emojis, exclusive members only videos. So you get an extra video a week, like it could be a draw along video, vlogs, things that I get up to. You'll get shout outs at the end of my main channel videos and I'll also provide photos and status updates so sketchbook pages, whip artwork, videos and lots of different things like that and please don't feel obliged to join or anything but any members that do join will be greatly appreciated and will help me and my channel out for future um, things I guess. So yeah, all you have to do is click the join button there or there'll be a link at the top of this description box. So yeah, let's crack on with the video. Hello fellow artists and welcome back to another video. So today, upon popular demand in my community post, I have a Timu large <laughs> art haul that I'm going to do. There's a few things in here that aren't to do with art, so I'll show them anyway. <laughs> Don't worry, I will be doing up crate 43 like afterwards as well. So yeah, I'll put you on top down view and we'll get opening opening it. Well, so this is very close together, but I think I'm gonna start with this mini package first. So I'll move the big one to the side. Now I can't really remember much of what I ordered. So yeah, let's let's just open this. I'll probably bring the camera down a little bit. Scissors always makes things easier. So in here, it's very small. We have some 24 ocean colour set, and these are the colours. So I'm going to open it anyway. Zoom that in. So it looks like we've got a swatch sheet as well and these are the colours, they look super cool, I like I like the whole concept of this <laughs> and I don't think it was that expensive e either. Right let's move on to this big package, so I'm just going to cut these off. I will probably have to move this to the side and then just show everything like separately. So the first thing is this giant um, sketchbook which is a hundred sheets. I am actually going to open it because I want to see what the paper is like inside. I don't really need any more sketchbooks but I bought this anyway. Oh, it's a cream paper and it just feels pretty slim and it smells it smells a little bit <laughs> it's not too bad uh, so this is sketch paper for fine tooth surface drawing dry media graphite charcoal colored pencils and pastels I'll probably just use this for sketching or like fun fun little stream nights or something so yeah I got this also inside this package I got some washi tape and it just slides out and they're just like little floral ones, fruity ones so they'll be good for like packaging orders and things like that so yeah, got some washi tape fun art related, I got some cow socks <laughs> and I also got some cow slippers <laughs> They feel really soft actually. Then we also have one of these. Now this I was very interested in. So let's just open it. I have seen a lot of YouTubers have this. Art YouTubers. So let's open it. 
open it up. There we go. So apparently this holds a lot of water inside. You have palettes for your paint. Um, paint brushes sit in here like that. Apparently it's a lot easier to like clean water and stuff. And I suppose this can be used as a mixing palette as well. So yeah, I will probably be using this a lot when it comes to painting. Probably mainly like gouache and things. And it's, it's quite sturdy as well. So yeah, that's not going to break. So yeah, that is another purchase. <laughs> so this is this. I also got some of these pens. I've needed some brush pens a lot because I go through them very quickly. No idea what this brand is. Never tried them before. But I don't know if you can see that. Japan sort of kind of brush pens and things. So they've got that one there, very nice. I think they're all different, I don't think they're the same, yeah. Very different points. So you know when I'm doing my doodle art, I will use these for those. So I'm very excited about, about these three pens. I also ordered some thank you stickers roll for packaging orders on my shop. If you would like to buy anything from my shop, the link is in the description box below. I do have cool things on there like stickers and everything. I also got myself a brand new pencil case, which I probably don't need, but <laughs> I'll do it anyway. So this is it here. And let's just open it and see what compartment compartments are inside. So we have a zip here to put pens in more pen slots and same again on, on this side and then if we open the second one I think this is what helps it like float up 3D-ish so you can fit more stuff in yeah that's what that's for so you can have it flat or like thick, if that makes sense. Probably took me a long time to get to to that, but yeah, that is the pencil case. I do need, I did need a big one, so yeah, got that one as well. Next up, we have some pens, pencils with thick lead, I believe. Ah yes, I bought a metal barrel pen and the lead is 2B which is one of my favourite leads to sketch in. I do have this in my Mass Technico pencil as well, so that's very good. And I think these are extra leads, yes, there they are. So I got, I got those as well, and then we have some, these are kind of like the Muji style pens, but they just look really cute, which is why I got them. So we have a little pig design, I think that might be a, a blue pen, I'm not too sure. Then we have a mouse, I think that's a mouse. The camera going to focus? No. <laughs> so you have another, another one of those pens. Let me zoom in, it might do it if I zoom in. The bear one, and then the last one is a little panda. Right, so next up is, this is so funny, so I've been playing a lot of Minecraft recently and I don't know if you know, but my favourite all-time animals are little bees. So 
I got a Minecraft V pin. <laughs> Gotta love Minecraft and bees. And I think the last thing that was included in this haul was some more mailers to mail like pins and things out to anybody that buys from my shop, which is a good purchase because I needed it. Now, I actually want to swatch these watercolours, so I think we should just swatch them together and see what they're like. But I will tidy up around me first. Right, I've got all of it set up. Now let's swatch them and see what they're like. This is going to be exciting. Hopefully they're good. Apparently they're quite glittery, supposedly. And it says they're ocean colours. They don't look very oceanly, oceanly at the minute. <laughs> they kind of look like earth tones. I don't even know if there's enough swatches for all the colours. This looks a little bit... Then again, my eyes could be deceiving me. Yeah, so leave um, a comment down below if you have ordered from Timu before. I'm very new to it. I found it through the Artifati Discord, which I will leave a link to in the description box. It's such a lovely community full of fabulous crafters, artists, so as and genu genuinely just nice people so I would highly recommend checking that out if you'd like to make new friends and plus we all learn a lot from each other as well like tips and tricks and new crafts that we've not done before and finding new shopping places like Timu. These, these colours are looking cool so far. I like them. I need to do another watercolour piece again. I'm actually thinking of doing like a paint along video. Doing some Zelda fan art. I've been playing a lot of Tears of the Kingdom recently, which I'm having a blast with. Anyone else play that game or play any other games? is so satisfying. I love swatching. I know a lot of people like to watch swatches, swatching videos. Well to say this is supposed to be an ocean colour, they don't, they don't look very ocean like do they? I do that as I'm like swatching a blue colour. <laughs> kind of look I don't know how to describe it. Does anyone know what I'm trying to say? Because I don't. I know you're supposed to keep them in the lines, but it wouldn't be an Emily Arts video if things weren't kept in the lines. <laughs> I don't know if they're light fast or not. I know nothing about these paints. I suppose I could test it if I put, put put them on a one side on a window and one side in the darkness and see if the sunlight makes a difference. Right, we're on to the last colour now. We did have enough swatches on the card. 
I kind of would have expected there to be a lot more blues in this, but there isn't. So I guess that's how, I guess that's just what it is. So these are the paints, and these are how they were swatched. So I might need to zoom in a lot more. There we go. So there they all are. Leave a comment down below what you think of this set. Do, do you like it? <laughs> do you think you'd get it for yourself or what you would actually paint with this? And yeah, that is going to conclude the Timu haul. <laughs> and yeah, I just want to thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please leave a like, comment down below what you think, share with your friends, subscribe for more. And I'll see you next week with the Upcrate unboxing. So yeah, okay, bye bye. <laughs>